Hey guys, Professor Bill, Comic Book University, and Harley Quinn, issue number 63. This is a year of the villain. I will spoil the ending for you in case you're not interested in, or the only interest that you have in this comic book is the year in the villain tie-in. It's only a page. It's a single page. So I will tell you what happens there. I'll show you the damn thing. It's actually really cool, but I think... There's more than enough reason to get this book regardless, personally. So I'll, I'll tell you the spoiler at the end of this video. But you should buy the book anyway. Just saying. So, yeah. Um, Death Becomes Harley. Sam Humphreys is the writer. Otto Schmidt is the artist. The letterer is Dave Sharp. The cover is Guillem March and Arif Prianto. The variant cover is Frank Cho and Sabine Rich. Harley Quinn was created by Paul Dini and Bruce Frickin' Tim. Harley's mom is dying of stage four cancer. They find out that there is no stage five because this is the killer. And um, through the process, Harley winds up being killed. That almost seems weird. But yes, yeah, she's being chased by death. Now, I guess this could have been cool in its own way if it was actually the, the black racer. But no, instead, it's just the hooded figure of death. So it's weird, but... That's actually what happens in this comic book. Um, it all gets better, though, <laughs> in its own Harley-esque way. It's funny that the book that was just meant to be copying off of De uh, Deadpool is doing a better job than Deadpool. At It's basically Harley Quinn is out Deadpooling Deadpool. Uh, I usually hate that kind of an analogy, but it fits. It genuinely fits. This is a fun comic book, man. I can't get over how fun this freaking comic book is. So I promise to show you the ending, right? I'm going to be a man of my word. There's uh, this little thing where it's like, oh, here comes the, the Legion of Doom drone. And it comes right up and then, ba bam, Luther shows up. And she already knows what's happening. She, she knows what's happening. She knows that he's coming to offer the totality thing and blah, 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 blah. Fulfill the highest potential. You don't actually see what the offer is. She wants the offer, though. She wants the offer. It's like, just give me the offer. Give me the power that I need to be awesome. That's all she wants. Now, what does this actually mean? Did she go evil? Did she break bad again? Maybe. Maybe. I don't care. This is awesome. And I love whatever's about to happen is going to be awesome. There's just, there's zero doubt in my mind about it. This book, I don't feel this book could necessarily be bad. As long as it stays like this, it could break bad all at once. It won't be bad. There's a separation there. <laughs> Great book, guys. I highly, strongly recommend that you go out and, and get this issue. Is it a jumping on point? It can be. It genuinely can be. Just know that she's going through some trials right now, and she went through a trial unwittingly in this one, but she's doing a good job at passing. She's only got one more trial to go now. God only knows what it's going to be. But her mom has cancer, and she's trying to deal with that. That's the thing that's grounding her right now. That's her tether. But she was made an offer, and she seems to want to go bad. She actually put on the whole Harlequin outfit thing again. You know, the, 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 the ear top things again with the bells. I don't know where they're going with this, but I am definitely along for the ride. Consider me already buckled in, man. Boop, five-point harness. Let's go. Professor Bill, Comic Book University. Class dismissed.